What's up guys, this is Coach Donnie from Elevate Yourself. I'm always excited on volleyball days, but I'm especially excited today because it is our first open gym that we're gonna play together in over two months. If you've been following along my volleyball journey this year, we've been competing in the VLA, and we've been also practicing against the UC Berkeley men's volleyball club team every week as a way to prepare for that because their team is pretty good. But now that we're all done with our VLA tournaments, now it's back to our regular Thursday night open gyms. And the fun part about open gym is you get to see different people every night. The second reason why I'm excited is I get to test these brand new knee sleeves from the Go Sleeve company here. Make sure you watch my last video where I tested the calf sleeves from the Go Sleeves company where I share my first impressions about those products. Right now it's 7 a.m. and I'm not playing until 8 p.m. tonight, but I will be wearing these knee sleeves right now because according to the claims, it does improve recovery and blood flow. So just a brief description about the product. Not only do they offer the usual support that you get from sleeves, but they also allow for greater mobility compared to other knee sleeves. And the most important aspect is the kinesio tape effect that this product claims to have. So the knee sleeves are essentially supposed to be like reusable kinesio tape, which is amazing for anyone who has used kinesio tape before. Now let's unwrap these bad boys. Inside the first one, all right, we got this cool black. There's the company logo, and I think this is where the knee goes on the circle. So you can see pretty standard stretchy nylon material for the sleeves, but it doesn't feel as stiff as other knee sleeves I've tried. Ooh, that's cool. Quick study, but it talks about how to put the sleeves on. I'm gonna definitely need some of these instructions because it does have adhesive material inside and that can make it tricky to put on, especially if you have hairy legs like I do. And we got the blue one, that's cool. They sent me a blue and a black one. Now I finally get to look cool for once having two different colors. So going back to what I said about having two knee sleeves, oftentimes I always recommend getting sleeves for both legs even if you only have an injury or want support on one leg because you don't want to have an altered perception of support it's better to get two sleeves so that both legs get the same stability, support, and recovery benefits. If you only get it on one leg, then this leg that doesn't have the sleeve is gonna get stronger at a much different rate than this leg. So you want the legs to perform and improve at the same rate, if that makes sense. First, they say to flip it inside out. So this is that adhesive material that they talk about that operates like kinesio tape. And if you remember from my calf sleeve video, it definitely does act like kinesio tape. I was really blown away. So I'm hoping that these knee sleeves are just as good as the calf sleeves. A couple inches below the kneecap. Flip it inside out, there's a kinesio side. And we roll it up until the circle goes on the knee. First try, how about that? Okay, got some pretty decent mobility there. So far, so good. I don't like it when sleeves are too stiff because you need a good range of motion when you're playing sports. But it's tricky because you also want support. Wow, it fits pretty, when you follow the instructions, it goes pretty easily over the kneecap. Very nice. All right, got two on, get to look cool. Can't wait to look cool today for once. So what's interesting about today's test is that it's only 7 a.m. right now. I'm gonna do my live Q&A session for my Patreon, so make sure you sign up for that if you wanna join our monthly live Q&A sessions where you get to ask any question you want and I'm here to answer them for you. So I get to test these knee sleeves sitting for an hour at my desk as I'm doing Elevate work. And when you're sitting, you're not getting a lot of blood flow. And if these sleeves claim to improve blood flow by opening the capillaries and all those benefits, we'll see if it helps with that. And then I'll also be standing a lot today because I'm training two clients for both jump training and volleyball lessons where I'll be just standing and entering balls and giving instruction. So another opportunity to have decreased blood flow, will it help my knees feel good as I'm coaching or will they feel stiff like they usually do from standing all that time? And then my favorite part of the test, which is working out at the gym and then finally playing volleyball tonight. I'll check back in with you guys at the end of the day to see how my first experience with my knee sleeves go. Just got here at UC Elite Volleyball Facility to work with my jump training and volleyball lesson client. Still got the ghost sleeves on, getting ready to pack the volleyball gear for the lesson. Uh, 
just finished the lesson. I was standing and giving instruction for two hours straight and I was blown away. I was able to do some cold demos. That means no warm up. And usually I know I'm gonna feel a little stiff when I do like a, a jumping approach without a warm up to demonstrate for my clients because I don't really have time to warm up as I'm coaching, right? I wasn't 100%, but there was no achiness. So very impressed so far. We'll see how it feels during training and playing tonight. just finished my workout and volleyball reps with Kai and my body actually felt pretty light with the knee sleeves. However, when I was lifting, I did feel a little bit restricted behind my knees when I was doing some deep squat movements. And I'll talk more about that later because now I got to get some food and go straight to open gym. Just got to the open gym. Time to test these out tonight. Uh, look at how many people are here tonight. We got six teams all getting ready for Elevate Spring Invitational Tournament, which you guys gotta stay tuned for.
Just finished playing four games. I could have stayed for a fifth one, but we got a tournament this weekend. So I think recovery is going to be more important. I got the reps I needed and I don't need to get greedy. Just be as recovered as I can. And as promised, I'm going to keep the ghost sleeves on on my way home to see if they really provide some recovery benefits. Dude, look at these cuts from my cat, man. That's how much I love my kitties. Just got home, time to share my thoughts on the Go Sleeve Knee Sleeves. So I've been wearing them since, gosh, I think like 7.30 a.m. and right now it's 10.30 p.m. So I've been wearing them all day and 
I just want to see what it felt like. Um, if it is for recovery, you know, you do want to wear them for a while, especially if you plan to do a lot of activities. Um, in the morning, I sat with them. My knee was pretty much at a 90 degree angle. And honestly, I don't recommend wearing these sleeves at that angle. Um, I did feel like it was cutting off some of the blood circulation where the back of the sleeves was scrunching together. And because it is fitted, because it's supposed to provide support, right? When you bend your knee while something's fitted, it just compresses it. And it's not a knock on the design because this is designed for activity and it's designed for your knee to flex and extend. So for me to sit for two hours, I mean, it makes sense that it would cut off plus circulation. But in case some of you are planning to try to improve circulation while you're sitting, not going to work very well. So next activity, I did some private lessons and was standing and doing some lifting demos. And that actually felt really good. And I never even thought about this. Like if I'm going to be coaching a tournament all day, I actually might wear these sleeves because I actually get more sore and stiff from coaching than I do from playing all day because you're just standing in that locked knee ankle position. And no matter how loose you try to stay, you're just not moving very much when you're coaching. So I felt really great doing demos on the fly, like just doing some deep squats with the barbell and then doing some jumping demonstrations on the court. I mean, it wasn't max jumping because you shouldn't do that if you're not warm, but I didn't feel that same stiffness that I usually do when I do a cold demo when I'm coaching. So that was really great. So I'm definitely going to wear these when I'm coaching and, and training. Then fast forward to my volleyball reps and weight training. Felt pretty good. I, I was really impressed with how much natural movement I was still able to achieve with jumping. Um, now, one area that did feel a little bit restricted was when I was doing some deep squats. I was still able to squat deeply, but because when your knee is bending that close, like when it's um, when it's collapsing, meaning you're bringing your ankle to your butt, right? It, it just collapses all that material in there. So if you do happen to do an activity that requires a lot of that type of knee flexion, where your knee is bent all the way into a deep squat, or I don't know what other sports there might be, uh, maybe gymnastics where you have to get really low all the time might not be that great for that uh, But if majority of the time you're kind of in a standing or in like a no more than 90 degree bend position I think it's fine like basketball volleyball CrossFit I know some CrossFitters are pretty happy with this one and runners I heard runners are going crazy over this one. So what I would I wear it for training next time? Yeah, if I really needed some extra recovery or if I was doing like three workouts in a single day I would still wear it um, I just wouldn't prioritize a lot of deep range motions with that. Fast forward to the volleyball at night. Uh, yeah, it, it, it felt great playing volleyball just like my reps. As soon as I pulled in, uh, I took the sleeves off and my knees, they just felt fresh. Like I was really blown away at how fresh it was and I did a lot of activity today. And definitely the recovery benefits are there. Now, it's not going to magically make all your pain disappear. The recovery benefits realistically from any type of brace, you're looking at like 5, 10%, 15% benefit uh, realistically, right? It's not magically going to change your body. These are kind of assistant things. I definitely recommend wearing these on the car ride on your way home to uh, continue to get that recovery benefit and blood flow. But usually when I take my sleeves off for other knee braces, you do feel restricted. Like it just feels like blood flow is finally returning to the area. But these felt like my knees felt like they could keep going and my ankles felt good. My calves feel good. So definitely going to continue to wear these as I'm playing tournaments. I might not wear them for usual training because I think it's important to have a good baseline and know how your body feels naturally before applying some braces. Now, if you are recovering from injury, I do recommend these knee sleeves because they do provide a little more support than I thought in terms of like the compressive ability. I would actually prefer something a little bit lighter and thinner because I do end up going in deeper ranges of motion when I'm playing in defense. It did feel a slightly restricted when I was going into like a deep passing posture um, or just had to get low. So I hope they come out with a lighter version with the same adhesive kinesio tape benefits with some lighter support, but really just a sleeve very similar to the calf sleeves. I'm actually really happy with the calf sleeves. They're very light, not very restrictive, and you just feel the benefit of the adhesive kinesio type 
uh, application in the calf sleeve. So I definitely would wear this if you need that extra support in the knee because it is a little, it's not stiff, but if it is a little more fitted than the calf sleeves. So those are my first impressions. I'm gonna release another video in a couple weeks with my full review of the ghost sleeves, knee sleeves, and the calf sleeves once I've tested the knee sleeves for a couple more weeks and get a feel for them for a little bit longer. Now, Ghost Sleeves is a great company that I've actually decided to partner with. I've tested their calf sleeves for a while. I've also talked with the owner and tested some of the other products and I really believe in what they're trying to do. And so they are one of my partners and the benefit of that is all my fans get 15% off with my discount code linked in the description box and you get to use my link too to make sure you get that 15% off any of your Ghost Sleeves products. So I highly recommend these. I'm going to continue to try their other products and continue to review them. So stay tuned for that.